hands out Wonder why the hands on me Girlie, why you tripping? Why you trying to get the man out? Hey, what is good everybody on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel here at Rapid Flex. This is probably the most anticipated request, like the most requested video. Uh, since you guys know I live in the like Washington, Seattle area, you guys wanted me to come visit Sneak City. The reason why this was like the most requested video because you guys wanted to see my full experience going in. I'm not selling anything, I'm just in for the trade. Uh, so hopefully we get something crazy. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Leave a comment if you guys like this vlog and make sure you guys consider subscribing because we're on the road to 5,000 subscribers. So I appreciate all the love and support you guys have been giving me the last couple days. So hey, let's go ahead and get it. So that's cool that we record? Yes. Okay, cool. So the number one thing you guys always want to ask when you're coming in at a sneaker store like this, always want to ask if, um, if you guys can record. That's just the respect of, you know, just recording. So a couple Jordan ones. I think it was like three bio hacks, uh, one black gold metallic. Okay. Holds and then uh, two trap spot like this. Cool. And are you just looking for cash or do you want to try to trade up? Uh, probably trade up. That's cool. I've seen a couple of uh, seen that was interesting, but it's kind of like a kind of store credit that you guys get. So, they're all dead stock too. Awesome. Alright, except the sweatshirts. These guys are one? Yeah, I just worn once. Yeah, you guys only they've only been open since I believe August, right? August, the videos yeah. I've been watching since August, and it's crazy how like crazy you guys been blowing up the last couple months. So very inspiring, and like I said, congratulations! <laughs> Thank you, guys. you so awesome. much. We're super blessed. Super yeah. blessed. Uh, Two twenty-five each on the biohacks, and then one seventy yeah. on the metallic. Yeah, it's like eight fifty. Eight fifty. Okay. Like fifty each. We do fifty each. That's cool. That's cool. So nine fifty. Can you do a thousand credit? Take a look and see what you want, and okay. then if it's been here for a while, it can work a little bit. Okay, cool. Because I was, I know I on your website. I don't know if you still have the Travis Scott fours, the DS pair. In the size, size eight. eight. Yeah, yeah, we do. We definitely do. Um, you do uh, willing to do a straight trade for that? Uh, I mean the store credit is nine fifty. I'll have to see what we have for the Travis. Okay. As they do have a website, thesneakcity.com. I'll link them down below in the description box. How to get a DS pair, because it's really hard to get, a, honestly, a decent pair um, in a good condition, because people are like selling like for a used pair for like seven, yeah. six hundred bucks. As soon as you wear those in the rain too, it's like the suede on there gets all water stained. It's just really hard to keep those guys like, yeah. especially out here in Seattle. I would, <laughs> it's like a summer shoe almost. Oh, for sure. So I'm going to go ahead and grab these. So if you guys were wondering what the trade was, we did, uh, my three, I did three biohacks, uh, black metallic golds, um, and then two Travis Scott uh, merchandise uh, sweatshirts um, for the dead stock Travis Scott fours. So, you guys let me know who won. Obviously, Sneak City always gets the love, so uh, yeah, it is what it is. I'm gonna call it what I like. So, when it comes to reselling, um, starting up your resale business, what are like maybe like the top five advice would you guys give to somebody? Um, mostly, mostly for the younger ones. I feel like the younger, you know during this time around they're trying to make money right, uh, during yeah. high school times and you're not going to school or not working. So what are some advice would you give um, for resellers, younger resellers out uh, there? Make sure you're really building your connections. Make sure your homie doesn't give you a good deal and then you're not giving one back. Like you've got to build these connections, show love to those who show love to you. Don't burn bridges, don't sell right. fakes. If you have a fake and you sell it, own up to it, you know. Um, you don't want to get a bad rep those go fast in the sneaker community. Yeah. Everybody right. will find out. When you're small, really utilize the apps that are given to you. StockX, Goat, Check Check, all the legit checking apps. I mean, those are all resources available to you. They do cost a little bit of money, but I mean, it's when it. you're small, I think those are very like important apps to help you grow. And one thing we've always said is uh, get your small nickel over a fast time. Right. Start small, you don't need to buy a $800 shoe and sell it for 1200 you know. Start with the 60 the $100 shoe, sell it for 150 make a little profit and build your income so that you can eventually do that spend more. Too. Yeah, do the volume, worry about yeah. that first over the most hype shoe there is, you know. You don't need to be investing so much right at once. Consistency is like one of the be biggest things and obviously ever since you guys been open, I feel like you guys been as as consistent like crazy because it's crazy like you guys orders online constantly getting people in the store and then just doing that back and forth so i guess the last question is how do you guys manage to multitask <laughs> while you're getting a big traffic of people coming in it's so. hard it's hard it's definitely something that's new to us like 
with opening the store like before when we were just like literally in like in the comfort of our own bedroom doing all this in our home like we could just like do customer service on the phone and like get orders shipped when they needed to be but here it's like we have people coming in like needing to sell us stuff and then she needs to go in the back to get a pair of shoes it's just like we just work as a team really well we communicate what needs to get done um just time management too time and like management. prioritizing okay obviously when we first get here we got to pull everything that sold online so that somebody in store doesn't accidentally buy it and then we're like shoot we got to refund this guy now you know um time management and then just working as a team and like i said prioritizing everything we need to get done and customers first bang Boom, there we go. hey you guys here from yeah. sneak city like i said yeah, we, we appreciate you guys what oh, you yeah. guys are doing thank you the future of honestly having a woman perspective in the sneaker culture is, is, is awesome so yeah, we so appreciate much. what you guys do so oh, yeah. hey we're okay. always interested in buying selling trading hey this is the way to go first time being in the shop good vibes what are your guys goals uh since you guys just opened up what are some of your goals for next year because i know 2020 has been like stupid yeah down it's been crazy we basically yeah. like opened in the middle of this pandemic which i mean going into it that wasn't our plan like we didn't expect this to hit to hit us like that but I mean, with our online presence and then just like all the support from the city has been super awesome. Like I said, everyone starts somewhere. I think in, in my in my belief, I honestly see you guys like going way to the top. You Thank guys, you. you guys, and like Cam Kicks have been yeah. honestly yeah. in the trend yeah, too. So too. yeah, so make sure you guys go check them out. It's the Sneak City. I'll link them down below in the description box. Um, their website and as well as their IG. Appreciate you guys like Thank you so much. With you. So, Thank oh, you we'll do elbows. We'll do elbows. There we go. <laughs> Shout out to Tia and Anastasia. Really great people. I would honestly give it a 10 out of 10. What do you think, Ellen? 10 out of 10? Yeah, 10. Shout out to my cameraman. Let me put him in the vlog. Okay. Never really in the camera, but hey, shout out to my cameraman, Alron, today. Let them, let the viewers know. What, what would you rate their star? It is definitely a 10 out of 10. The vibe was cool. And yeah, they had some some heat out there yeah the, if you're not familiar with the uh, sneaker community out here definitely check them out i know there's not much sneaker stores out here but they are on the rise so do not sleep on seattle uh so shout out to everyone in seattle that is repping uh, what is good everybody on youtube just got home from seattle i just wanted to give you guys a little more of an outro for you guys show you guys what i picked up obviously you guys seen from the last clips what i picked up as you guys can see right here size eight dead stock travis scott fours i'm never leaving my collection i told bay uh, she's in the um, on the camera so i appreciate you recording um as you guys can see the travis scott fours dead stock uh they think they had these listed for 1100 on their website and i knew coming in to their store this is what i was aiming for it was either these or sb dunks um like i said i think i, I think the travis scott four is a lot better not bay yeah. um I honestly, it was, it's really hard to find a really good, decent pair for a really good price for the um, Travis Scott. So I thought that was definitely a really good opportunity to get my size on these once again. I, I think this is like the third time I've owned the Travis Scott 4s in my collection. And this is actually my first dead stock Travis Scott 4. So as you guys can see, is it is it focusing? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So as you guys can see right there, um, dead stock all over the shoe. Um, once again, shout out to Tia and Anastasia out there in Sneak City. They're doing big things, so make sure you guys don't sleep on them. Uh, their links will be down below in the description box to their website and as well as their Instagram. Make sure you guys go check them out. I wanted to give you guys a full experience and I know a lot of you guys were requesting that video since I live out in the Washington area. So it was a highly requested video from you guys. So make sure you guys smash that like button if you guys enjoy this vlog. Uh, if you guys were not in my last stream, I did a giveaway. I end up I was supposed to give away uh, one pair of shoes. Uh, one pair of shoes then i ended up giving away four pairs of shoes so as you guys can see smoke grays was the first giveaway that i gave out size i think it was size 10 biohacks another pair i believe it's size nine and a half and then biohacks again size eight and then a size nine in the black metallics so shout outs to all the giveaway winners um i will be shipping these out on monday so that's pretty much it for the video if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys like this video um if you're new here please consider subscribing to the channel guys we are on the road to five thousand subscribers so i appreciate all the love and support that you guys have been giving me just got these in what was it thursday friday i believe i yeah it was thursday that i got these in as you guys can see just a first look of the trophy room jordan ones i think i might stream to share with you guys so make sure you guys hit the bell button below to be notified when that stream goes up because I'll have a special guest on that stream and then showing off the trophy room ones. So 
like always this is pretty much it for the video uh, you guys know the vibe you guys know what to do make sure you guys stay blessed stay healthy make sure you guys stay wearing a mask uh this is Rafi Plex. catch you guys on the next video Wonder why they hands on me Girlie, why you trippin', why you tryna get the man song Love it when you dance